How's it going guys? Welcome back to the channel and welcome to another episode here of NBA 2K20 My Career Mode. We're going against the LA Clippers, man. This should be a good one. Oh, I'm going to start out with a steal right there, but Williams able to keep the ball. Here we go, man. I'm expect. I, I hope this is a close game, you know. Oh, man, what a rejection there by Rudy. Mike Conley with the pass. And I'm going to get the layup. Nice pass, though, by Conley. I thought I was going to miss, but I'm surprised the ball actually went in. Three misses. Conley with the rebound. He didn't want to pass to me this time. It's all good, though. Pretty good screen there by Rudy. Nice little jump shot. And I'm going to miss. Gobert with the rebound. And the putback with the left hand. Look at that. So the Jazz with the four-point lead now here. Pretty good start here defensively here for the Jazz, except um, I'm leaving my guys wide open. So George with the ball now. And he misses. Rudy with the rebound again. We're going to go for an alley-oop. Why not? To Ed Davis. There you go. My first assist. Six points for the Jazz. And the Clippers have yet to score anything here in this game. Minute and a half without scoring. So it's now Davis on the defense. Can't get it. Conley with the rebound. And here's another. I don't know. That should have been a foul. That should have been an one. But Leonard, <laughs> he, he wasn't called for a foul. But at least I got the two points. So 8 nothing here. The Clippers really to a bad start here. It was two minutes without any points here in this game. And I just left. Patrick Beverly wide open, and uh, he's going to score the first two points here for the Clippers. I mean, the fans are still pretty quiet. It's like, this point, they gave up on them. And I'm going to the free throw line. Williams with his first personal foul. So here I am at the free throw line. 83% at the free throw line for me. So I'm good with the first one. And I'm good with the second. Two for two. Eight point lead here. So we're still here in the first quarter. Minute 14 left. I uh, have 12 points, two assists. I do have a turnover. Uh, just a random turnover that I wasn't trying to pass to Jeff Green, but I still turned it over. But who cares? Pretty good lead here. Nine point lead here. That's been the biggest lead so far in this game. I have a pair of threes. So I'm playing all right. Defense has been great. Rudy with like two blocks already in this game. So no problems with the defense. Five on the clock. Oh, I'm going to miss a three. So I only made two. I've missed two. So four attempts total. And he misses a three. But they get the rebound. Good defense there by Joe Ingles. I don't know if I should pass to Rudy. Yeah, why not? He missed. Can't get the rebound. Just bad pass, 20 seconds left. Oh, there's a steal. There's a steal. Huge steal there for me. I've been picking up my steals lately. I don't even want to pass to Jeff Green. Oh, come on. Every time I try to pass to this guy, I'm going to turn the ball over, man. Come on. So I'm obviously not going to win here with the jump ball. But come on, man. I was afraid to pass, and that's what happened. There he Oh, at least Donovan Mitchell got it, and he puts it in with 12 seconds left let's see if I can get another steal here this time I won't even think about him passing the ball if I'm able to get the ball back uh, it's tipped by Rudy he's gonna pass to me gotta hurry up oh so close but it's an 11 point lead here for the Jazz to end the first quarter so we're now here in the second quarter it's an 11 point lead Let's see the bench. I mean, they've been playing pretty good the last couple of games. They've been the ones that have been getting us a pretty good lead when we're struggling. But right now, it looks like, you know, they're going to keep it about the same. A nine-point lead. 30-21 to 21 is the score here with two minutes and 40 seconds left in the first half. And that should make it into a seven-point lead here. So it looks like we got Bojan, Mike Conley, Ed Davis, and Rudy, and... That's going to be the second foul here on Paul 
Paul George. Got to pass to Conley. Let's see if I can give him a screen here. That was a pretty good screen. He shoots. Oh, there you go. Yeah. I set up a screen for my teammate. I'm surprised he actually went for it and attempted that shot. Good defense there by Davis. They don't want to pass to me. Going to pass to Conley. And no good. No good. Man. I got to give props to Conley though. He's pretty good with his defense. He's getting rebounds. He gets steals here and there. Good, pretty good points, I guess. Oh, and one. Man. The Clippers are really struggling here with their fouls. This is like my second trip to the free throw line, but total, I've drawn three fouls. Good with the free throw. 32 seconds left here in the first half. 39 to 25 is the score here. I have 15 points. Man, the Clippers have been struggling still with the with the fouls. Even Kawhi Leonard already picked up his first. Like, I'm pretty sure everyone on this team already has a foul. Oh, I'm going to be rejected. I'm going to get the ball back. And I'm going to be rejected again. Oh, man. So every time I get a rebound, I'm going to be rejected, bro. Seriously. For three. Misses. Here's my chance. More than halfway. Can't get rid of the ball on time. That was close, though. But uh, it's the Jazz. You're up. 39 to 25. It's a 14 point lead here for the Jazz to start off the second half. I got 15 points. Uh, not a lot of points though. Only 39 points for us. A three. Yes. On green. Perfect release right there. Almost stole the ball from George. Not really, but that was close. That's Williams with the ball. He passes back to Paul. Gets a pretty good screen, but still not enough to get up. Oh, never mind. Oh, he finally got something in. Only six points. He only has six points in this game. The other hand, I have 20 points in this game. And the lead would just increase by this point, man. Oh, come on. I'm trying to get a steal, bro. Rudy. Oh. Rudy couldn't do anything right there at that point. They just dunked on him. There you go. There you go. Not a bad start here in the second. We're on a good pace to hitting that 30 point mark again. But looks like the defense is struggling here already. We haven't gotten a stop. No turnovers. Patrick Beverly with only four points. Oh, that was close. Four consecutive field goals. It's not 24. Oh, George with the three. And the Jazz will call a timeout. First of the game. Okay, so after that timeout, I'm being taken out of the game. We still have a 14-point lead. I hope they could at least keep it up. Still about the same 14 point lead. I just hope they don't lose that lead, you know, in the next couple of minutes. Let's see. We still have a pretty good lead here. 14 point lead still. Oh, I left Paul George wide open, but they didn't pass to him. That's good. 40 seconds. Oh, what am I doing? Here's a block. Never mind. Oh. Oh, there you go. Finally got a rebound. Man, I can't believe I actually forced Paul George to miss and then get a rebound myself. I'm stepping up my defense. Man, this guy doesn't want to get away from me. Might as well go. I was trying to go for a fadeaway. Didn't work. Paul George with really good defense right there. Not getting away from me. But they're still behind though. Four on the clock. Misses. And they couldn't get the ball on time. 
So all we have to do in the fourth quarter is protect the lead. I just hope Quinn Snyder doesn't take me out because this guy will legit take out his best player when I'm playing my best. So fourth quarter is underway. All we have to do, like I mentioned, protect this lead. But George with the deep three, he misses. Man, Mike Conley's getting like all of the rebounds today. Might as well hand on the ball too. And one. Man, Mike Conley's playing playing pretty good. You know, defensively and offensively. What a pass though. Man. And one. I don't expect them to miss a free throw. There you go. Perfect release. Perfect release. I'm going to leave Paul George for a second. I'm going to try to get a steal. Never mind. They didn't work. So now I have to guard the big guy over here. Look at the high difference. That's Conley. Going against Williams. Forcing. And another rebound there by Conley. I wonder how many rebounds he has. No defense right there by the Clippers. Twenty-six. I'm still trying to steal the ball away from Paul George. Nice defense there by Ed Davis. Conley passes my way. Our chemistry is really growing with Conley and I. Especially in this game, you know. I'm passing to him most of the time. He's passing to me a lot. Oh, not even. That was way short, my man. To Conley, I'm going to set up another screen for him. Let's see if it works. We're building a lot of chemistry here. Bogey with the three. And a timeout by the Clippers. 60%. He's leading the lead in three point percentage. We're back here from the timeout. The Jazz leading here still. Four minutes left in the fourth quarter. Paul George finally gets something in. Took him a while. How many points? He only had like 10 points. I don't even know. Haven't heard a lot from him in this game. And one. It's going to be the second foul in her route. Here we go, man. From the free throw line. Can we get 29? Yes, sir. Yes, we can. We can get 29 points here in this game. There's plenty of time for me to get 30 points. I just, just hope Quinn Snyder doesn't take me out of this game. Here's a block. Oh, I forced him to miss, though. Here we go. Who's going to get me a good... Oh, they're going to double me up. Not going to work. Let me get that screen again, man. Come on. That didn't work. Why did he pass? To, why did he pass back? He had like, oh, Conley's gonna be rejected. Shot clock violation. I still don't know why he passed back to Conley. He could have gone there and an easy dunk, probably even draw a foul. But uh, I don't know what happened there, man. I don't know. Come on, that's Bogey going against George. George shoots. He nails it. Oh, no one in front of me. Never mind. Oh, I missed. The ball just didn't want to go in, man. Oh. That was awesome. And another miss by Rudy with the rebound. Good look. Miss three. Rudy with the rebound. And he gets it in. So there's a minute left. Of course, I'm going to be named the player of the game. I got 34 points so far in this game. Uh, like I mentioned, there's only a minute left. So I don't know if I'm going to be taken out of the game. Another win here for the Jazz. Man, we have a 22-point lead here, if I'm not mistaken. But man... Have we been unstoppable both sides offensively 
defensively, Conley and I, you know, building some great chemistry, you know, he's passing the ball more to me, I'm passing the ball more to him, you know, we're scoring, so like I mentioned, um, I know it's going to be taken out, so 79-57 is a score here, with 152 remaining here in the fourth quarter, let's see if the Clippers can get something done here, maybe not, so it looks like the only starter out there is uh, Rudy, Rudy Gobert. And Royce O'Neal with the foul. I don't want to see that, man. So we're going to go ahead and skip all the way to the end of the game. Oh, it looks like there's eight seconds left. 95 to 66 will be the final score. All we have to do is run the clock out. But yeah. But anyways, guys, it's going to be it for this episode. So I hope you guys did enjoy. And if you did, make sure to hit that subscribe button. If you guys are new to the channel, show some support. I would greatly appreciate it. But yeah, we'll see you guys in the next one. Stay tuned for more NBA 2K20 My Career Mode and Madden 20 with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers and Tom Brady. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.